Hey guys, um, it's Alicia here. So for this video, I'm actually going to be doing a Ulta haul unboxing. <laughs> um, I ordered some stuff for their 21 Days of Beauty, and I'm just going to be sharing what I got, and then I think I'm probably going to um, film a get ready with me with some of the products that I got, and I didn't get enough for a full face, so like I'll use stuff that I already have in conjunction with that. But yeah, so that's what I'm doing for today's video, so go ahead and stick around and watch the unboxing. <laughs> By the way, this is my cat on my shirt. My mom got this shirt um, custom made when she was in Florida a couple years ago, and it says spoiled rotten on the back. So yeah, because he is spoiled rotten. Okay, so first, I only got like four things. Um, first, I'm going to show you the reason why I placed the order, and it was because of this. I wanted to get another MAC paint pot because, as you know, if you've already watched some of my videos, I have one that I am really loving. Um, I have the shade Soft Ochre, and that's what I bought was another Soft Ochre, so I got that. Um, I got an eyeshadow palette that I've never tried, and I'm very excited to try it now. It's an oldie, but I've heard it's a goodie, so I want to try it for a while. So I got the Lorac Pro Palette, the original, and it comes with a little um, eyeshadow primer. So, open this. I'm not going to open my paint pot since I already have one open. Um, that's just a backup. For when I run out, and let's see. Okay, so it comes with a little behind the scenes eye primer. I probably won't open this quite yet, but I will get some use out of that at some point. And then there's a the Lorac Pro palette. I like how, um, like compact and sleek it is. I'm really excited to try this because I'm trying to like dive into more brands I've never tried. I've never tried anything from Lorac. So I just kind of wanted to try the original palette because the colors really speak to me. I feel like it's something I would enjoy. So I'm definitely excited to try this out. Um, and then I also got something I have been wanting to try for the longest time. But anytime I would try to order it, it was always sold out. Whenever I would go to my local Ulta, they would always have it out of stock. Like, I could never get my hands on it. I was lucky and got three of them because they had to buy two, get one free sale. So I got three since they're pretty small bottles of the <laughs> Catrice Prime and Fine Dewy Glow Fixing Spray. I am so freaking excited to try this spray. I have heard so many good things about this. I'm all about the doughy, the doughy, I'm all about the dewy, uh, skin. I have a couple matte foundations that look good on my skin as long as I, like, put a hydrating primer, a good moisturizer on, but I feel like if I add this to it, it'll make it even better. I like the packaging. It's really sturdy. So I'm very, very excited to have that. And then the last thing I got is something else that I've been trying to get my hands on for a while now. Wasn't sure if I was ever going to try it, because like I said, same story, always be out of stock. I would check my local drugstores, I checked Walmart, CVS, Walgreens, some of them would have a spot for this, but they wouldn't have the product. Same thing, I went into Ulta a couple times recently, and they just did not have the product, but they had a spot for it. Anytime I looked online, it was out of stock. When I was starting to place my order and pick out my products, it was out of stock, but I just happened to check right before I placed it. And it was in stock. The e.l.f. Coreless Putty Primer. I have heard so many amazing things about this. I don't know if it's one of those products that's really overhyped. Or if it's actually good. But I am going to try. Because I don't have the Tatcha Primer that this is a dupe for. And I'm never going to buy that one because it is so expensive. I don't think... It's really worth the money for that expensive of a primer for me right now. I'd rather spend more money on stuff like an eyeshadow palette or I did pay mostly full price for my first one. This one I got half off for $11. It's normally $22. My first one I had $6 of um, Ulta Rewards. 
so I got $6 off my first one too. This was on sale, it's normally $44, and I got it for $26, so I love me a good deal. <laughs> and like I said, these were buy two, get one free. I also had a $3.50 off $15 um, purchase coupon from Ulta that you can use on any drugstore products, so I got $3.50 off this, this, you know, whatever, I got $3.50 off my order ordering some drugstore products so all in all i think i got some really great stuff and i can't wait to use it i have another ulta haul that'll be coming because i made another order i was planning on trying out the touch and soul no problem primer so i was gonna wait to order until that came on sale but then i decided not to get that because i just bought this primer and it's a pore filling primer and I already have a couple pore filling primers that I like, so I didn't feel like I needed another one, but I really wanted to try this one, so I'd rather try this one than the other one, in my opinion. So hopefully I like this. If I don't like this, I may still order that one. I don't know, but we're going to see. <laughs> um, so I did order some other stuff that was on sale as well, and then a couple things that weren't on sale, but I had my eye on. So I will put that up on my channel when I get those products in too, and then I will try using them in some videos. So yeah, I'm very excited for that. So that is all for this video. I hope that you enjoyed watching, and I hope you will stick around and watch some of my other videos, but I'll see you in my next one. Bye.